Antipsychotics are medications used to treat symptoms in psychosis-related disorders. There are two main types you need to know, typicals and atypicals. Typicals, or first-generation antipsychotics, usually end in azine or pyridol. These work primarily by blocking dopamine receptors in the brain. And remember from our Parkinson's video, dopamine helps with movement and motor control, reward and motivation, mood regulation, and memory and attention. One important group of symptoms to know for your exams is extrapyramidal symptoms, or EPS, which refers to involuntary movements and motor disturbances. This includes dystonia, which is involuntary muscle contractions, pseudo-Parkinsonism, which includes shuffling gait, bradykinesia, tremors, and rigidity, akathisia, which is restlessness, and tardive dyskinesia, which is involuntary movements of the mouth, face, or neck. Atypicals, or second-generation antipsychotics, usually end in pine or dome. These work by blocking both dopamine and serotonin receptors in the brain. Serotonin, often called the happiness hormone, plays a role in mood regulation, pain perception, and the sleep-wake cycle. Important to note, atypicals are not recommended for use in patients with dementia as they've been shown to increase mortality rates. Comment below for part two and check out the full study sheet in the Nursing School Success Bundle.